I saw this and I thought, dude, that's one big baby. I'm Rob. That's Liz. It's his morning crew on his radio. Okay, let's go back to the day that you gave birth to your children. Mm -hmm. I'll ask Liz this. How big was, how much, I'm not not how big, how much did Taylor weigh? Eight, six. Hayden. We'll get to Hayden in a minute. Luke. (laughs) Okay. Was like eight, 12. I think it was eight, 12. Hayden? 913. That was big. And he was two weeks early. Okay. And from what I understand, babies in that last month gain a pound every week. So if I would have taken him to full term, he would have been over 11 pounds. Would you say 12 pounds is a lot? I can't imagine. You can't? Like that, I want to run. (laughs) I just want to, what? Ask Kayla all about it, because that just happened for Kayla in California. 12 pound baby. Kayla, I feel for you. Seriously. Yeah. Like, and not even just the birth itself, but carrying. Because carrying Hayden, I told him I think he had like a small apartment in there with a <laughs> recliner and a car, two car garage. <laughs> like, what were you doing there? But yeah, so Kayla, 12 pound baby. Yeah. And, and here's the thing the doctor said she looks like she's three months old. Looking at the picture, honestly, to me, even looks a little older now i mean the rolls are i love them (laughs) her little baby rolls Mm -hmm. i love that but yeah cutest and those little newborn diapers i don't ever buy like for a baby gift i don't ever buy those newborn diapers because they're in it for a hot minute and then they've moved on to the next stage so i don't think she ever saw the newborn Mm -hmm. diapers on this baby those cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> Those cheeks. I just want to get a hold of them and You know, there's stories behind birth. A lot of different ones. Yeah. Like in cars. Oh right. Elevators. Yeah. Didn't make it at the door of the house. Yeah. Front lawn. Four days you were waiting. For yeah, for <sighs> this woman was forty eight hours, by the way. And then a C section. Ooh. Mm-hmm. Four I mean forty eight hours. Forty eight hours for this wait. young lady. It was. She said it was excruciating. I can't. I'm thinking no epidural. I don't know. Well, the epidural itself. I mean, to me, that was the worst part of the whole thing. The epidural. Yeah. Well, but I had C sections, so okay. I never had. And don't hate me. I I never had a labor pain because I had the C section. No hating for me. <laughs> there are women like. Let me tell you. Yeah, I, get I, it. I, I can tell you I something. Totally not different. Get different, that. different. Yeah. yeah. What's and don't let no guy say, I had a kidney stone. I know what it's like giving birth. No, that doesn't. No, I, that don't fly. I've heard it's the closest thing to childbirth that how, a man can go through. How would, well, I don't know. I don't know. I've never yeah. had a kidney stone, so I don't know. <laughs> but, and it, oh, okay. So TJ's weighing in. With oh, the, what, TJ? Uh, okay, kidney stones are miserable. <laughs> I was in the hospital screaming like I, well, bloody I, murder. But I will say at the end of it, you know, a woman who goes through childbirth gets the sweet little baby. That's true. So mm-hmm. you walk away with a kidney stone. a bottle. I don't know. Stone. <laughs> so if by chance you have a story to share, we'd love to hear from you. 800-447-7234.